Hey everyone, a good friend of mine asked me to throw together a little two minute teaser to tell more about our Keto OS from Prove It that we launched to the consumer market about five, six weeks ago. And I had some time between cases, so I ran out to my car here to um, throw together this video. Um, he's intrigued because I keep calling it a fourth macronutrient. And as you know, there's three. You know them very well. They're protein, carbs, and fat, and they all have an energy yield. Protein and fat, both four calorie, or protein and carbs are assigned four calories. A uh, gram of fat is nine calories. So if you break down any label on any product, whether it's a protein shake or let's just take heavy cream, that's an easy label. One serving is five grams, there's 45 total calories. Well, if you look at the label, there's no grams of protein, there's no carbs, and it's got five grams of fat. Take that five times nine calories, which is assigned the energy yield to. Uh, a gram of fat that's where you get the total uh, calories of 45 so think about this for a minute we do have a fourth macronutrient that we're introducing to the consumer marketplace through an exogenous ketone product beta hydroxybutyrate and mct oils so when you put it in your body there's a higher yield of energy so whereas protein and carb are both four calories our product yields 5.7 calories. Think about that for a minute. That's a pretty bold statement. So anybody that you share this with or anybody that hears this that knows anything about nutrition, to hear somebody or even a company claim that they've got a fourth macronutrient, uh, that certainly would grab my attention. Uh, another uh, point worth noting is not only does the ketones, exogenous ketones we put into your body yield a higher return with energy, 5.7 calories, but it also requires less oxygen than it does glucose to make the same amount of ATP, adenosine triphosphate. That's just a fancy way of saying cellular energy. So you'll see a lot of athletes, a lot of runners, a lot of people that are CrossFitters, um, you know, the Spartan racers, a lot of people will take this product and they'll do the same event or the same workout or the same run or the tra same training session and they'll say, gosh, you know, I did it but it just felt like I didn't have to breathe as hard or I didn't feel like I was as tired. Well, that's exactly right because, again, our product has a higher yield, not only in energy, but also requires less oxygen to create the same amount of ATP that glucose requires. So, uh, pretty important facts. More importantly, we can prove what this product does in your body physiologically. I think it's important to understand that in the nutritional supplement industry, it's very hard to validate your product. We can within one hour with just a single serving, either through a urine test or a blood test. So again, quick bullet points, a fourth macronutrient, higher yield energy, whereas protein and carbs are four calories, this is 5.7 calories, all natural. Uh, another note, uh, ketone bodies don't require insulin to enter into the tissue. Uh, so it's a cleaner fuel, much preferred by your brain, and then again requires less oxygen to create the same amount of ATP, adenosine triphosphate, which is that cellular energy that is so very important to each and every one of us. So hopefully this has at least piqued your interest, giving you a little bit more to chew on, and certainly if you're like me or anybody in the fitness industry, this would be fascinating news if in fact it's true, and I can promise you it is. So hope that helps.